All right, everybody, what's going on? Welcome to episode one of the St. Bonaventure Bald Eagles franchise here on NBA 2K23. This is localized content on YouTube, localized underscore content on Twitch. So yeah, let's get right into it. We got 12 teams, all of which are in New York. We got two conferences, Eastern New York and Western New York. I guess that would be flip-flop for you guys. Um, 12 teams, six in each conference. And we're going to play five games. One, two, three, four, five. You can see that. One, two, three, four, and five. Five games. Uh, so I guess I should turn the trade deadline off, but we'll do that in the next season. So we can take a look at rule changes because there's a whole bunch of rules changed. Uh, players can come in when they're 18, uh, no more 10-day contracts, uh, all-star game will be four time to quarters, no coaches challenge or butter be buzzer beater reviews, no five second back to the basket, uh, backcourt violations won't be called, uh, 10 seconds to get uh, past half court, eliminate uh, three seconds in the key for the defense, uh, foul out will be at five fouls, shot clock 20 seconds. Uh, top teams of each conference will be uh, seated respective based on their record. So essentially what it's going to be is we'll play our Western Conference because St. Bonaventure is in Western New York. We'll play fi the five other Western Conference teams and then we'll go to the playoffs. Uh, the winner of the West will play the winner of the East and the East will play their five teams. Winner of that will in the playoffs, we'll go play against the best team from the West. So that's how this will work. Uh, NBA jerseys during the All-Star game. Rising Stars, rookies versus sophomores. Top voter vote-getters across each conference. And only 10 players will be named to the All-Star team because there's so few teams. Uh, all, te or all draft picks will be determined by their record, not by the draft lottery. And that is all there um, so let's take a look at the teams in the western conference we've got the syracuse white wolves rochester miners buffalo charge niagara falls pumas jamestown skulls and us the saint bonaventure bald eagles and then in the eastern conference we got six teams over here the, the staten island colonials the Queens Pirates, the Long Island Bananas, the New York City Captains, the Albany Cougars, and the Bronx Bulldogs. Six teams over here, six teams over here. Let's take a look at the rosters. Starting with our own roster, the St. Bonaventure Bald Eagles, our star player is six foot five center Dante Towns. Uh, then we got uh, Jamal Anderson, six foot six small forward. Point, at point guard will have Ben Shaw. Amari Dawkins is our power forward, and Isaac Waters is our backup point guard. We got uh, Lucas Stewart Jr. He is our starting shooting guard. Uh, Eric Magley is backup four, uh, and then our backup fives are six foot seven Taylor Patton and seven foot five Cortez Canada. Uh, then another point guard, Monty Marion. Uh, Danilo Rogers is a shooting guard. Jared Carpenter is a small forward. Uh, Dorian Willingham is a power forward. And Christian Bolton is a small forward. And then finally, last guy, number 15, or the 15th guy on the roster is Darius Smith Jr. So that's our squad. Um, I'm not actually going to take a look at all the rosters right now. We'll just take a look at the rosters as we play them. So in episode one, we got the Buffalo Charge. So we'll simulate up to there. No, I don't want to trade the guy for second round picks. So we got Buffalo. Buffalo, 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 Buffalo Charge. Let's take a look at their roster. They have another short center, Donald Gribbs, um, then uh, six foot eight. And they got a seven foot four guy. So they have two short guys and then a, a really tall guy as well. So Gotta watch out for Donald Gribbs uh, inside for sure. Six foot four, two fifty five, and then they got Alan Peters, Jose Ratliff at power forward. They got Edwin Jameson and Davian Hollingshed. Uh, small forwards they got Sal Fontecino. That's a great name. I know I butchered it, but it's a great name. 
Maurice Heckman, Hot Nun, Hot Nun, nice. Kirk Tinsley, Fricann, Tippets, Juan Pablo Button, and point guards Andre Anthony, Carlton Dawson, and Hollis Walker the fourth. That's Buffalo's roster. We're gonna play five minute quarters on superstar difficulty. Uh, and that's about it. We got one game in each round of the playoffs. And yeah. So that's what we got. Game one of the season is at home. What are they gonna wear? They can wear their brown their poop jerseys and we're in our white jerseys. St. Bonaventure Bald Eagles hosting the Buffalo Charge in the Eagle Nest. Whoa, that's going to be copyright music right there. Let's get going. Two tiny centers, 6'4", 6'5", respectively. Apparently he's really athletic though. Take him into the post. So fuck it every single time. Don't pay towns. Ribs is killing us. We'll take that though. Go back and forth. Shooting for the home team. I forgot that. That sucks. That is nowhere near going in. So we need to figure out how to score. We got Cortez in. I think he can actually shoot it a little bit, even though he's 7 for 5. Hey, that's a nice bucket there.
They bring a double. Another nice finish. No ball. That stays. No way. Substitution on the court. Twenty-six seconds left in the first quarter. Let's run a zone. They haven't beat us from the outside. Boom. More pass. First personal foul, second team foul. At the line for the other home team. At the line for two. Get in there, ball. Perfect. Please, no bucket here. I would be very upset. Our big boys bring the ball to the court. Our center. Let's do a little reverse pick and roll action. They got their big guy on us. He can't keep up. They got the little guy inside. Count is too big for that. He may only be six foot five. He's got 300 plus pounds. I think it's 326. <laughs> Give Ratliff that. Ain't no way. Thank <laughs> you. 
and it's not going in. Nice block, Patton. That's what we just got to keep doing. Force it to Towns. He's our way out. Hopefully he can make a free throw. There we go. One for four. Ain't no way. I don't care if you're tired. So much stronger than that. So far off. Get up there, Magley. We're down five at half. That is not ideal. shooting 29% from the field. It's a great, great, great play. No, perfect. There we go, Stewart. Ribs is killing us. Got the 
cram it on us. Come on, Cortez. that I meant to hit X. There we go, Anderson. If you miss that, wow. Oh my gosh, my home crowd just screwed me up. Left my hand again. Chino. We stink. So with our centers all bringing the ball up the floor. Near Canada. Magley in the corner, perfect release. There we go. More down two. That to the top. Magley's a dog. So we have it tied up 23 all. Substitution on the 
I'm there. All right, going into the last quarter. Tied. This is really a lot better than that quarter. Maybe it wasn't our defense, maybe it was just our offense that actually came into the life in that quarter, I'm not sure. Can't let Gribbs destroy us. So I go off the Anderson may be a Ben Simmons archetype. Oh, Shaw. How did you let that happen? Back. No, Gribbs. Come on, y'all. Anderson.
How are we in a zone with four people around the basketball and we don't get the lead? Let's go. Nice move. Let's go. He's waking up at the end. 32-32. No. Grab that board. Perfect. Three point lead, thirty seconds left. They're going to foul, get it to Stewart, especially if Anderson is an archetype of Ben Simmons, because I know, I'm pretty sure our center is an archetype of Zion, and our small forward is of Ben Simmons. One out of two, better than nothing. Four point lead. Over there. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Hey, if I could get a perfect release every time, that's cool with me. He's got seven. We win. We win. Point victory. Game one of the year. St. Bonaventure takes the dub over Buffalo. 39-32. Take a look at the stats real quick. Three people had seven. It was Magley, Towns, and Stewart. Six points. Anderson. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's a Ben Simmons archetype, so we'll keep that in mind and quit shooting threes. Patton had four. Dawkins had three. Water said to Canada had a bucket and then Shaw just didn't score, so he played bad. But on their side, Gribbs killed us, went five for five. But Anthony, you know, it seemed like he was really killing us. But if we're being honest, he gave us that win. Three for 13, over six from three. Thanks everybody for watching episode one of the St. Bonaventure Bald Eagles here on localized content on YouTube, localized underscore content on Twitch. Thanks and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.